Well, Moe's original exhibit has been here since this building opened in 2006. The original tree was a deadfall tree, so it had lived its life. We, the zoo cut it down and installed it in concrete inside the Discovery Forest for Mo to be his exhibit. It had its life, it rotted out, and it decided it had, was going to collapse one day. Now his exhibit at that time was still limited, but when we took that old exhibit out and replaced it with this new exhibit, we're able to keep him out 24 hours a day still, and he has a lot more room to roam. It has different elements associated with it that will hopefully allow Mo to have uh, more natural experiences while he's out here in the Discovery Forest. He will also be able to climb down one of the trees and be able to go to the ground, which he hasn't been able to experience before. In the wild, it is very natural for sloths to descend from a tree every seven to 10 days, and they go to the bathroom. So this will allow Mo to have a natural bathroom experience. Some of the things that we added that are different from his last exhibit are misters. So we'll be able to turn on light misting water to simulate rain and uh, being in a tropical location where sloths are naturally from. We also have uh, vents running up through the trees that will blow either cool air or warm air on him depending on the season and uh, we have a lot more climbing space for him. He'll be able to make a full circuit uh, around and be able to travel across the pathway where guests are walking below him. Our whole goal here is to create a more natural exhibit for this animal and experience and give him as much space to move around as possible 